Okay, so... I've been attempting this challenge for a couple days because I just found out about it. And I did a bonus three hour stream last night of attempting this challenge. Uh, as you can see, I've restarted a lot of runs and we have a negative 21 ring streak right now. So I'm just gonna attempt this for a little bit longer, see how we do. If I don't do it, oh well. Uh, but this is what I wanna do for the rest of the stream. Uh, this challenge is called It's the Key. Uh, the way this challenge works is that uh, you could only pick up keys throughout the entirety of the run. You are not allowed to pick up uh, any um, any coins, bombs, or health. That invalidates the run. It's easiest to do it with the lost because you can take free devil deals. I think only like f 10. Not even, according to Steam. This off, uh, off stream, I managed to finish Five Nights at Mom's and I managed to finish, uh, Zip. take that. There's one of them that's like sleep in 10 beds, which I for some reason don't have. I think that one might have gotten bugged or something. Okay, well, do my holy mantle for this room. Uh, I did accidentally last night unlock Tainted Lost because I had an amazing run uh, and then I fucked it up. So I was like, fine, I'll just go unlock Tainted Lost. So I did that. That almost pushed the bomb into me, and I would have been very upset if it did that. The run wasn't anything special. I just had a really, like, some really cool effects. Flat stone. I'll take it. You know, if I don't fucking die in here. not put me in a hole. I don't even know if Lost can fall in those holes. If he can, I still don't want to fall in the hole. Cool. Torn photo, we have a lot of tears up. And I'm happy about that. Yeah, I installed a Minecraft Explosion Sounds mod just because. I can turn it off if I feel like it, I just don't want to. I just remembered something that I want to do if I if I lose this run. <laughs> okay, I've been seeing Guppy's head a lot every time I do this. I don't really take it. Uh, I pick it up for Guppy. Euthanasia? Yes. Yeah, I have that over uh, Mama Mega. See, like, this is cool. Honestly, Black Hole's not bad, but I'm gonna re-roll it anyway. This room doesn't even have anything in it. However, I can do the challenge room. More tears up? Please don't kill me in here. I would love to not die. I hate fighting Widow. Widow is annoying. 
This, this version is a little bit better because it's smaller, so I don't get hit as often. Troll face haunt. I hate you. I actually have the tears up to be able to work with this. Don't hit me. This is like my favorite version of Haunt because it doesn't have lasers. Okay, pick up the key. Is it achievement to get five tears up items in one run? I don't know if it's tears up items or tears up pills. Sissy long legs. It's something. See, this run already seems really promising, especially when I pick up the trinket later. Because this is a trinket that Lost has a really easy time getting from beating bosses, which gives you plus 10 luck. And, uh, yes. Well, I already have three tiers up items. I, I could have sworn I should have probably already gotten that by now. Like, I've played this game so much that I haven't gotten five tiers up items in one run before. It's ten? I looked at the description of it and it said five. I could be wrong. They might have changed it. Uh, Constellation Prize I'll take. Uh, range. Devil Deal. Lusty Blood. Alright, this, r r this run looks promising. Just 10 on the wiki, then I'm just bad. Never mind. Anything in here? Nothing in there. If I get a card to teleport out, I'll do that. I'll say this run is going really good so far. There's a dice room. If that's a re-roll and restart the floor dice room, I want it. Uh, please don't kill me. And I'll, I'll open it. Reroll all item pedestals. That's a good dice room. Well, I'm going to use that. Uh, yeah. I could wait for the boss item as well. But you know what? I think I might wait for the boss item as well. That way I can just do that and reroll both if I need to. I'm not taking up- I'm not picking up any pills. You, you can't see me picking up pills right now. I'll pick up the Ankh because sure. Hey, Bighorn, I can do- I can do Bighorn. Just summon the little balls from Little Horn so I can get a, a damage up and we'll be set. Thanks. Give me that damage up. Okay, big horn's gone. Uh, there's my trinket. Thank you. We now have our 10 luck trinket, so we're gonna be shooting Euthanasia shots more often, I believe. I don't know if Euthanasia is affected by luck, but I'm hoping so. Okay, so now we're gonna do this. Now we have re-rolled items.
mystery sack. We do not want mystery sack. Little haunt is definitely something we do want. Well, this re-rolled to this. Now, I think I remember hearing that you can pick up items that give you health. You just can't pick up health off the floor. I don't know if that's correct or not. I am going to re-roll that, however, if there's uh, two rooms left. I'm just super scared. I, I, I feel like soul hearts and black hearts still count, even if you're the lost. Health up pills of the lost still count. To my understanding. I would just like a better item that's not just giving me three bombs and a trinket that I can't use. Binky. Again, I don't know if this works or not. I want to be extra, extra careful. So I only want to pick up items that I know won't give me any hearts or soul hearts, because I don't know. There's only, like, guides that people have made, and not, like, anything on the wiki about this. Because the wiki only says, do not pick up hearts, coins, or bombs throughout the entire entirety of the run. Oh, there's a library here, too. That's amazing, actually. Uh, free bookworm. Alright, well, I can re-roll these. I think they'll just re-roll the more books, though. And honestly, I might want Book of the Dead instead of my dice. There's clearing, clearing rooms that give me orbitals that block shots. I think that's something we want. I'm gonna go try and re-roll the, um, the boss room one more time. And if I get anything good, cool. If not, I'm gonna pick up Book of the Dead. Placenta, can't use it. We are gonna go pick up Book of the Dead. I'm not gonna touch the chest. Also just use monster manual just cuz. So we need to hold on to this for like really big rooms or just, I don't know. Really big rooms or boss rooms is where I want to use this the most. <clears throat> I'm gonna hope that I don't need to reroll anything else throughout the entirety of this run because this is what we're sticking with. I don't know why I didn't go in the big room first. That was literally my entire reasoning for wanting this thing. You can break those with euthanasia, and that's funny. Okay, here we go. Big room full of spiders, easy kills. Okay. There we go, we got some orbitals, we got some friends. Let me kill things. Perfect, we'd like that key. Unless I think the things that the my skeletons kill also count toward my damage. Uh, a bum that I can't do anything with. A key bum I can't do anything with. There's a chest room. I don't know if I want to risk these. I don't think I'm gonna. 
Uh, I'm gonna try and clear other rooms and go to that big room after I get my thing fully charged. Never mind, we have to go in there. I'm always afraid to open up chests. All these things that I want to pick up but can't. And euthanasia helps so much. There's another big room, that's nice. use it in here. Got a lot of enemies in here, but it's still something I can use it on. There we go, I need that. Uh, I gotta go with it for the item room first. As long as I don't pick up any pickups by accident, I think this run is good. I just need to not suck. Let's check if anything's in here. Alright, well that works. Bother touching that chest, don't care. This is not the way to the item. I love going every single path that I could possibly go, except the path that has the item room down it. It happens every time. Hourglass. Would have really liked to reroll that. We're glowing hourglass. No thanks. Just pick it up so it doesn't show up again, and we're good. Uh, boss is this way. I think I had that once happen recently, where I started a floor and the boss room was like two two rooms away. From the start. Hello, peep. One of my failed runs last night, there was a really cool, I think it was a damage up item or a tears up item in one of the challenge rooms. And then I, I picked the item up and then bloat showed up. And that was really cool. Needless to say, I died. I've also had things where I accidentally hit a fire or accidentally hit a poop that uh, completely annoys me. I don't want to open up those chests. That could be dangerous. This room, this room's cool. It's so nice that you can break these with the euthanasia shots. Nice chain reaction of killing everything for me. <laughs> Please, no. Oh, 
Oh, I'll take that. I lose my Book of the Dead, but I can redo the floor. I don't know if that's worth it to get an extra item and an extra boss item. To me, that does not seem worth it. I'm just gonna do the boss first. It's also the perfect room to use my book in. Can't even pick that up, so. I almost picked up the coin. Um, I feel like Goathead is the way to go. I know it's Necropolis 1, but I think Goathead's the way to go. Like, there's not that many Devil Rooms left. But I still would like to guarantee Devil Rooms for possible Krampus with Flump of Coal. Uh, possible other things. You never know. See if there's a battery in here. No battery, don't care. Check the shop. I mean, really no point, but. Let's use the book again, get some other guys. Uh, ooh, eight inch nails. I haven't seen this item in a long time. We're doing a shit ton of damage now. <laughs> Again, if I do not pick up any things by accident, we're fine. I have a feeling we might be able to actually, like, beat Satan this time. <laughs> Curse of the Blind. That means I can't see what items I'm picking up, right? That's annoying. That means I can't take the Devil Deal. Because the Devil Deal item could possibly give me health. There's things that give black cards and stuff. I can go in there just to see if Krampus is in there at least. But that's annoying. I don't even want to pick up the item room item if I can't see what it is. Yeah, it could possibly be something good or possibly be something bad and I don't want to risk it. Uh, Justice. Uh, charge key, don't mind if I do. Yeah, I don't need to pick up anything else. Alright, well, it didn't spawn anything else. I was hoping I could spawn another couple skeletons. Hello, Gamma, welcome to the stream. Skeleton. I should not die in here. Isaac. 
There we go, thank you, Euthanasia. This is the negative. I remember that. Again, I'm not gonna crab any of that because I don't know what it is. <laughs> yeah, that make that's a good point. I just don't play in normal mode ever. I can't remember the last time I ever played in normal mode. I don't really have to play in hard mode for this challenge. There's no rule telling me I don't have to play in hard mode. Or I do have to play in hard mode or not. That is entirely correct. Destroyed. I'm not picking up anything. No special things for me, thanks. <laughs> Ready to had an. Uh, an event going on because Saints Row 3 remaster release, so you bought Payday 2. Neat. Yeah, you're Loki. Uh, later tonight, uh, after my stream, and then after I have dinner usual time we'd play a game. Can't pick that up. Aw oh, cool, money equals power. Can't wait to get my uh, my 0.6% buff. Um, better than Judas's shadow because I can't use it, so. It would be neat if I did this challenge first try because I was planning on spending like another like three hours doing this like I did last night. I want to go in the chest room, but do I really need to go in the chest room? I really don't. There could be coins in there. There's no reason for me to go in the chest room. There is an achievement in the game that I found out about recently called It's the Key, where you have to beat the lamb with, like, get to the lamb and beat it without picking up any hearts, coins, or bombs the entire run. You can only pick up keys, as well as, like, cards, pills, trinkets, and stuff. But health up pills count as getting health, and that ruins the run, so I'm not picking up any pills. These things are taking away a lot of my orbitals. I think. I don't know if it has to be a challenge, it just has to be a regular run of Isaac. Maybe because I don't want to play Ultra Hard again. <laughs> it took me forever to beat that one. Here we go, this is a good room to use the, the book in. With Envy. Go in a big old circle. <clears throat> I 
Don't know which direction to go. Not this way. There's all, it has to be a thing when playing the Lost that more uh, chests show up. Because I, I, I get so many chests when playing Lost right now. Tainted Jacob win when I actually have a successful run as Jacob. <laughs> because I never have a successful run as Jacob. It doesn't happen. I want that so bad. Come on, drop like a card or something. <laughs> I want like a, a full card or like any card that teleports me. So that way I can pick that up. There's batteries in here. Like, the Jesus, like, I don't want to go in there and then have, like, bloat show up. <laughs> that happened to me last night where I went to go pick up an item and then bloat showed up. I have a mod that makes it so that any really good items in item rooms make the character pog. I'm picking this up and hoping that I don't die. Okay, stain. We're fine. For now. Never mind. We're dead. Come on, the fear, the fear, the fear from the ha from little haunt, fear from little haunt. Ooh, that was close. Okay, we got Jesus juice. Please put the the Pog Isaac emote in chat. <laughs> Thank you. Alright, please don't die to it lives, that'd be really bad. That's the scariest part of the fight, is dealing with the, the lasers at the beginning. Or, yeah. Alright, please don't hit me, 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 please don't hit me. Okay, and then dodge this. Use my book. Uh, we'll take the devil deal. Uh, Whore of Babylon. Uh, that should work. Yeah, cool. Uh, you're not a fan of Isaac Dumpy? Why not? Right, can we actually make it past Satan for once? In one of these runs? Because I've made it to Satan at least three times and lost every time. I have a Minecraft explosion mod. No, you can give me like flies or something, right? I really, really hope picking up Dead Cat doesn't mess with anything, but I'm picking it up. Now we have two thirds Guppy, because I, I think I picked up Guppy's head earlier. These will die in this room. That would be not nice. Ah, uh, we're dead. Ugh. Fuck these giant laser eyes. I have a mod enabled right now that gives me pre-patch holy mantle.
because Holy Mantle and Repentance lasts like 0.3 seconds, and then I would have died uh, if I did not have, you know, regular Holy Mantle. I don't know why Egg McMuffin decided to make Holy Mantle shit in Repentance, so I have Afterbirth Plus uh, Holy Mantle turned on right now. I absolutely would have died there if I didn't have that. Please don't die to like a fucking spider. Uh, I'm gonna go clear one more room to use this book. Should have probably waited for one of these rooms to use it in, but... I fucking hate these ghosts, I'm gonna die in this room. Okay. I always die to those fucking ghosts. Or I always get hit by them. Alright, let's try it. Rock bottom soy milk bet. So you gotta dodge your lasers whenever you wanna do the lasers. I have the range, so I'm just gonna step away. I'm not even close! I was so far underneath! Dead cat, that's right. That's right. I'm really hoping that doesn't mess with the challenge. Uh, well, my 10 luck achievement is, or my 10 luck thing is now gone, so. Rip my fun euthanasia shots. I'm really, 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 really hoping Dead Cat does not count as, like, having health. Alright, well, I can just run into that. Because I don't know what counts and what doesn't, so... I always like to be super careful. Oh, he spawned there again. Stop. I had Sissy Longlegs charm the Fallen last time, and it was just attacking itself, so that really helped. Come on, little haunt, get him. The nails are pushing him away, which is nice. Paying attention to the bullets. I was not even close to that bullet. I highly disagree with that. Okay, we're good. I finally beat Satan in this run. We have one more floor. Why do I fight it sideways? Because if I face it head on, he's going to do the brimstone at me. Uh, rotten baby. Yes. The void? No. Maw of the void? I mean, it's something. And Gimpy, which I can't use. Oh, taking one of them, if I have all of them active, just gets rid of them all. That's dumb. Uh, I mean, I can't use Gimpy, but I can pick up Gimpy. Just have an even more fucked up face. I just need to not die here. And you know, still not pick up any consumables that aren't keys here either.
Wow, you're really cool, aren't you? Uh, this room sucks. Ugh. I didn't see the spider. Go away. I mean, I need a trinket now. I can't even use it, so... I mean, if I can do it, this would seem like first run of the day luck. Because I did this for three hours last night and got nothing. Oh, there's the forgotten room. Can't go there. I hate this enemy. Alright, I'm just gonna go into the big room. Have to bite off, bite off that at some point. Three carry-on queens. I'm saying it. I don't know if this is the best room to use the book in, but I'm using the book in here. Carry on. Carry in. Why not? Oh, the book did nothing, apparently. Lots of headless horsemen! Hate this. She's away from me. Thank you, sissy long legs, for charming them. <sighs> Hello, Gish. Is there two Gishes? There's two of them. got feared so it stayed it stayed in place and I got scared. <laughs> Alright, auto mod blocking the word sissy. room. Not worth it. All right. The lamb. flies so it gives me that damage up buff I forgot about the the spin laser I forgot he has that move all those home okay does this count it's the key It's the key! Ace of Spades! 
has appeared in the basement. It's done. <laughs> Literally the first run of today, I decided to swap off of other thing to do this thing, and that works. 